today's topic is uh, some properties of exponents for multiplying exponents. First of all, I'll just give you some straight notes here. If I have a, which is called the base, to the power of x times a to the power of y, a straight note here is a to the x plus y. We can combine a product of two exponents, as long as the base must be the same, we can add the exponents. And here's a demo. If I do 2 cubed times 2 to the fourth, well, we can see that 2 cubed is 2 times 2 times 2. And then multiply that 2 to the fourth. This is 2 times 2 times 2 times 2. So this is going to be a 2 times 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 times we're multiplying the number 2 to itself, or which is 2 to the 3 plus 4, 2 to the 7th power. So when we're multiplying exponents, we can, uh, or multiplying bases uh, that have exponents, we can add the exponents. Uh, another property here is if I have a to the power of x, and then I'm going to raise all of this to the power of y, I can multiply these two. This is a to the power of x times y. As an example, let me take 2 cubed again, and I will raise this to the second power. So our property here says that this should equal 2 to the 3 times 2, multiply these two, 2 to the power of 6. Notice it's a raising a power to a power. Another way to do it is that this is 2 cubed times 2 cubed, which is 2 squared. And then this property up here says I just add the 2, which is 2 to the 6th. So here being another property where I raise a exponent to another exponent, I multiply the 2. Uh, final property that we want to talk about right now is if I have a times b and I raise it to the power of x, this would be the same as a to the power of x times b to the power of x. Each value gets this power of x. Very important that this is a product. It must be multiplication. So if I have something like 2 times uh, x, and I want to uh, raise that to the power of 3, this would be the same as 2 cubed times x cubed, or 2 cubed being 8x cubed. So having, or here you could write this as 2x times 2x times 2x, knowing that to cube means to multiply to itself. And here we have 2 times 2 times 2, which is 8, x times x times x, which is x cubed. A key uh, important thing here is that this has to be a product. 